Pag-umisa na po tayo. At uh, nagagalang po kami na kayo na tayo dito sa ating unang uh, public forum na Third World Studies uh, Center sa pakikipagtulungan po sa Office of the Vice President for Public Affairs. Ang tema po ng public forum series ay ang tama ba sa UP? Tama rin sa Ngayon po, ang katapakalin ay ang paksa na may tubo ba ang pagtulong ng UPI that counts as public service in the national So, ang unang bilang po ng ating programa ay ang uh, welcome remarks ni Dr. Maria Ella L. Atienza, Director ng Third World Study Center, University of the Philippines. Thank you very much, Dean uh, Dayo Freneo, uh, Professor Emeritus and former UP President Francisco de Menso, Professor and current UP Vice President for Public Affairs, Prospero de Vera, Prof uh, Professor Vicente Poblador, Vice Chancellor Melania Abad, colleagues in academe, students, ladies and gentlemen, magandang umaga po sa inyong lahat. At um, sabi nga po ni uh, Dean of Reneo, ito ang guna natin sa forum series for 2012 WP Third World Study Center. Of course, uh, for many of you here, you are familiar with the work of the Third World Study Center, which is based in the College of Social Sciences and Philosophy. Aside from research, publications, networking, and training, we conduct regular fora and lectures on important issues. The theme we have chosen for this year is Ang Tama Ba Sa UP Tama Din Sa Bayan? Because uh, we envision this uh, public forum series in the context of the ongoing activities of uh, UP and of course looking back various sectors in UP have often grappled with a lot of contentious public issues. We have discuss and analyze these issues and propose solutions. However, it might also be useful to once in a while sit down and subject the university and its relationship with society or the public to scrutiny. After all, various sectors have different images of the university. We often hear students and faculty describe the university as the microcosm of Philippine society. It reflects what is happening in the country and at the same time, we always pride uh, or take pride in the fact that uh, here in UP, students are the scholar ng Mayan. So as a scholar ng Mayan, we are also expected to serve the people. There are also other images that come to mind when we discuss UP. Uh, aside from, of course, the image of the scholar ng Mayan, there are those who criticize uh, UP as a uh, the ivory tower of intellectuals. There are also, of course, the images of uh, student activism and nationalism as a brand of or hallmark of UP. Uh, in recent years, we have come across the, the concept of Tatak UP, a brand bearing an enumeration of the supposed principles and practices of what and how it is to be UP or to be part of UP. Uh, we are now envisioning UP as a source or a factory of solutions which can be translated into policy proposals, patents, and other rights. Still, as a national university, we still expect UP to, to, to be a public good. So these are the competing images of UP and the forum series aims to bring together public intellectuals from different sectors of UP and society with critical consideration on UP's role as the premier state university. We will focus on four topics. The first topic today is UP's role in contentious environmental politics as a public service university. And uh, I think uh, Vice President Rivera uh, distributed some materials which uh, also highlight some of the initiatives of the current UP administration in this area. The second lecture will be the, uh, the second um, uh, forum will focus on the new forms of surveillance and security measures in UP. The third uh, topic will be UP's commitment to equity for its poor and deserving students. And fourth, the stance of UP towards the LGBT community. 
each topic will be an interrogation of the assumption that beauty is indeed a microcosm of society. We hope that the forum can be a venue for the UP administration to reflect on and refine its chosen architecture of intent and for the participants to offer alternative perspectives and directions on UP's role as a public institution, particularly how the university addresses the delicate interplay of private interest and public concern. We are grateful for the continuing support of the Office of uh, Vice President Rivera for this public forum series. Um, we are also grateful that our esteemed panelists have agreed to uh, join us today. We are, uh, Dr. Gomez is on his way, he is just caught in traffic along Ortigas, but he will be joining us uh, this morning. Of course, I will have to give credit to the research and administrative st staff of the Third World Study Center who have constantly worked hard in conceptualizing and implementing many of our activities, including this forum series. And uh, of course, thank you to the students, faculty, and uh, the audience for coming because uh, of course, we always have to discuss together uh, our uh, views of UP and where we think UP should be growing, particularly in specific issues that are important not only for the university and, but also for the public. So uh, good morning to all of you again and thank you for coming. And, Please join us in this discussion and open exchange of views. Thank you.